Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So as you can tell by today's title, I have got a Hollister swimwear haul for you. I am literally so excited to be filming this video because I've been putting it off for a while now just because I wasn't really sure on trying their stuff, but I am so glad I did. So I am gonna waffle on for a little bit quickly. When I was growing up in secondary school, I used to go in Abercrombie & Fitch, Gilly Hicks and Hollister all the time with my friends because they absolutely loved the shop and it was like the brand that everyone was wearing at school at that time. And I used to go in there and I used to like try on size large and it still wouldn't fit me. So I used to hate going in them shops because I really wanted to wear stuff from the brand and I couldn't because everything was just too tight for me. And that was obviously years ago. So size large, I couldn't even fit into back then. So, and I weren't even like that big then. Like I'm so much bigger now than what I was then. Anyways, I saw another YouTuber trying out their clothes. I know she works with them, but she looked really good in the stuff. And I saw on their website that they're kind of like into the body positivity movement um, and they've increased their sizes. So they go from like an extra, extra small to extra, extra large. I can't remember what the exact size is, but they do a range of sizes now. And they're obviously doing like the body positive movement, body confidence project or something like that. So I went on their website. I looked at their swimwear because I just thought, let me just have a look, see what they've got. And they actually have so much swimwear i was so shocked but like the patterns and the colors are very like hollister to me if, if that makes any sense like they're not neons and bold bright prints and all of this kind of stuff they're just very simple and nice and basic but they still look really nice so i picked five bikinis and i'm literally shocked to the core at how much i like this so that's kind of like a spoiler alert i also wanted to say i'm filming it a little bit different today because i've just had a tattoo done here um and it's healing i literally had it done yesterday and it's very painful it's healing so i don't really want to be in the bikinis that long so i'm going to just kind of talk show them and then try them on let's just get straight into the video Before I get into this I got all the tops in a size large and all the bottoms in an extra large I think a large is a UK 14 and an extra large is a UK 16 but they only seem to went up to an extra large which I thought they would have gone up to a bigger size if that's what they're saying on their website but so that's the size and I got I also want to say I did get 30% off free delivery and I think returns it's nine pounds to return it they take a charge out which is a bit crappy because they can afford to have free returns. I'll give the full prices but obviously bear in mind that they were 30% off. The first one is this really nice royal royal blue or Colbert blue or however you say it bikini bottoms. So these are cheeky and they are ribbed and they do have two little bits on the side. Um, these were £18 which I think is really good but like the quality of this is just insane. Like this is really good quality. They're thick, they're comfortable, they have so much stretch to them. They do have a little gold um, bar that says Hollister um, and the back is like a, they say cheeky, but I mean, it doesn't really go up your bum that much, which you guys know I prefer. But yeah, I absolutely love these. The quality is amazing and the top looks like this. So, it's a strappy top, it does have padding in, and then it laces at the back, so you can adjust it to however loose or tight you need it. And again, obviously it is ribbed, and it does have the pads in, which I didn't find the pads annoying, I probably would just leave them in. But the bikini is absolutely comfortable, you cannot fault the quality, it's really nice, it's so soft, and for the pricing I think it's really good. The top was £26, which is kind of a little bit more on the expensive side, but I do think you know you are paying for what you get and I think the price isn't too bad for a bikini and from being from Hollister as well. So the next one I have in two different prints so I'll show you probably like my least favourite one. So it's this red and white flowery one. Again it's just a normal bottom, they say it's cheeky but it doesn't really go up your bum too much. The bottoms were £14 and the top was £25 which I think is quite reasonable. The top is super super cute, it's a bandeau one and it has um, bone structure sort of thing down the side which isn't too hard, it's quite soft and flexible so it doesn't dig in and then the back is a gold clasp that you literally just slide 
in and out if i can get it in you slide in and out of the top so it does come with straps which i thought was really nice because then you can wear it as a halter neck and then obviously if you don't want to get tan lines you can take them off it does have pads which gives it some shape and structure i didn't find it annoying at all so i'd probably keep them in again um and it is elasticated so it does have a lot of stretch to it that bikini again is really good quality i think the price is reasonable for what it is it's super comfy it's stretchy the only thing i would say is i would probably prefer more of a cheeky bottoms um like maybe a more fong kind of really cheeky style bottoms that you guys know i love if you've seen my previous hauls but apart from that i can't fault the bikini it's really nice i think i'll probably go online to see if they have any other style bottoms because when i was online they did have different color bottoms and styles but i think this might have been the only ones but i will double check on that so the next bikini i have is the same it's in a really nice leopard print so obviously again it's the same style, it has a little gold bar on the back. It's supposed to be cheeky, but I wouldn't say it's that cheeky. The top is a bandeau style, which I do really like, because again, you don't get tan lines. I forgot to say, the outer part has like um, frilly type bits, which I think is really nice. It just adds a little something to the bikini. Again, it does have the clasp at the back, and it does come with straps if you want to wear it as a halter neck, and it does have the pads in as well so it does give you some support the top was 25 pounds which is the same price as the other bikini i do prefer the leopard print one on me um it's a little bit different i don't own any leopard print bikini so that one was a nice change i will say as well that i find with some other bandeau style tops they do sort of fall down they don't really sit properly but these ones they have actually got quite a nice support i mean they are elasticated all the way around so that probably helps but they're really nice i do like the bandeau styles from hollister they have really nailed it with that one like i said if you don't find you have enough support if you've got bigger boobs then you can put the straps on and that will help you out there but for like my size i think it's absolutely fine it gives really nice support it doesn't move it doesn't fall down they've just really nailed the style of the bandeau bikinis so the last two i've saved till last because they are my favorites now, I threw this next one in my basket with not much hope, to be honest. I just thought, ah, oh, let me just try it. It's a different sort of style, um, and it's a little bit different from the others. So, so, the top looks like this. The top part has, like, these nice frilly bits, and then it's just a scoop rib neck bikini top. This was £26, but, again, quality is insane, and it has adjustable straps at the back, and then it ties up into a lacy bit which is really nice because you can adjust the straps and you can adjust the lacy bit to how tight you want it again the top does have padding in which i actually really like it doesn't annoy me the material is so comfortable and stretchy it doesn't irritate me it's really really nice so the bottoms look like this so they are ribbed again and then they do have the hollister gold tab at the back and they are more cheeky these ones so i would say this is the definition of cheeky but I don't know how you pronounce that. High leg halt jambe? Jambe? I don't know. The bottoms were £16. And again, I absolutely love these ones. These ones shocked me because they sit how I like my bikinis to sit. They go more up the bum, so you've got more of the cheeks out, which I like. And again, the material of this bikini is so comfortable. It's super soft. It doesn't rub. It doesn't hurt. It doesn't irritate me. It's just perfect. It's a really nice bikini. And I think the straps with the ruffles add a little something because obviously black is quite plain um but like the ribs the straps and the like lace up back really add something to a simple bikini just to make it look really nice i will be saving that bikini for my holiday later in the year if it doesn't get cancelled who knows how long this is going to be going on but my rome holiday is cancelled and i've got disney in may which is probably going to be cancelled as well well i kind of hope it is just because obviously it's probably going to still be madness then so anyways let's move on to the last bikini so this last one was again one I think I just threw in the basket. I think I wanted to pick up a different top, but the top I wanted they didn't have in my size. They only had an extra small, so I could tell it was a popular bikini. The top is this really cute pattern. I think this is actually a really nice pattern for Hollister. This is actually more of like a bolder print, I'd say, for them. The top is £19, which I think is a reasonable price. Again, it does have padding in, which you can remove. I didn't say in the other ones you can remove them, but you can. And anyway, so it's a strappy scoop neck bikini, 
and then obviously it laces up at the back so you can do it as tight or as loose as you want it now again quality is absolutely insane it doesn't look cheap doesn't feel cheap it's really good material and the bottoms are my favorite just because i think it said fong style online but i'm not too sure what does it say on the super cheeky it says but i'm pretty sure these were like called the fong online and they were 14 pounds so this bikini is really reasonable especially with 30 percent off that makes it super cheap so the bottoms are obviously high leg they are quite cheeky as you can see and then the back has the gold hollister the, has the gold hollister logo and it also has some like ruching like some very minimal ruching um and you can tell they're obviously really cheeky but i absolutely love this bikini it's my favorite one out of all of them it really surprised me because i kind of forgot what i had ordered in a sense i knew like the tops that i'd ordered but forgot about the bottoms that bikini is definitely my favorite one i think the print's amazing i think it'll look so nice for my holiday later in the year obviously if i get to go so i'm going to be saving it for then but yeah i absolutely love that one they were all the bikinis i got obviously that last one was my favorite and then the black one and i do love the leopard print one but i'm not so keen on the bottoms and then obviously the blue one was really nice so let me just give some like my final thoughts so i am literally shocked by how amazing the swimwear is from hollister so i'm definitely going to keep my eye out on their website and keep checking like every so often to see what new prints they've got literally like i'm so shocked at how nice the stuff is like i was not expecting it at all so i'm so glad that i did this haul because now i've got more bikinis that i don't need so i don't think the prices were that bad because on average the tops are around 20 pounds they're like 21 to 22 pounds the bottoms range from 12 to 15 16 oh yeah 12 to 15 pounds so the prices are quite average i'd say they're probably a little bit more expensive than some of your typical brands like pretty little thing and misguided but you can't fault the quality the quality is there they don't look cheap they don't feel cheap they're super comfortable i do think they need to bring out some more bigger sizes though that's one of the things that are letting them down and free returns but apart from that absolutely love the swimwear i will definitely be purchasing more in the future so let me know in the comments below which one was your favorite i will leave all the links to all the items down below in the description box so i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please don't forget to give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video